We have a special guest in that juice box that you might recognize. Hey boys and girls, I am so excited to be with you today. My name is Father Tim. I get to answer a lot of the questions that you have about the faith or about me or about things. So let's get started. Juice box. <laughs> hey Father Tim, why did you want to be a priest? I wanted to be a priest because Jesus asked me to be a priest. I fell in love with the Eucharist in college. I fell in love with everything that a priest does, and I've been happy ever since. Have you ever seen a miracle happen? So I've never seen a double rainbow, but I've seen a miracle every time I go to Mass and every time I celebrate Mass. And you see a miracle every time that you go to Mass because you see Jesus's body and blood on the altar, that bread and wine literally become Jesus. And that's a miracle every time. You always have to wear black. I don't always have to wear black, but I wear that when I'm doing my priestly duties, which means when I'm celebrating mass, when I'm hearing confessions, when I'm being a priest. But I wear regular clothes to the gym. I wear regular clothes when I'm wrestling my little brother. I wear regular clothes when I go to the store. But when I'm doing official priest things, yes, I wear my clerics. These are called clerics. Why do we have to go to church? There's an amazing part of the gospel where all of the apostles are falling asleep with Jesus. Jesus is praying and all he wants is his apostles, his best friends, his BFFs, to spend time with him. And they keep falling asleep. Jesus goes to his BFFs, he goes to the apostles and says, can you not just spend an hour with me? And so Jesus is just asking us in the very same way, because he sees you as a BFF, can you just spend an hour with me? Think about it like that. We're going to mass to just spend one hour out of the whole week. How many hours are there in a whole week? Let's do the math. 168 hours. That means you can go to mass for one hour and be with the God of the universe and then you have 167 hours left just for yourself. Sounds like a pretty good deal. Do you live at church? Great question. I do not live at church. I live and I actually did the math because I counted it on my watch. I have to walk 65 steps outside of the church to get to where I live, which is an apartment next to the College Newman Center. Do you have a dog? I do not have a dog, but priests can have a dog. I love dogs. I think they are like the best animal ever. But as a priest, I am working with people and ministering and I have to be very free to say yes to other things. And so it wouldn't be fair to the dog. What do you think heaven will be like? I think heaven will be like an all-you-can-eat buffet where the food never runs out. It never runs out and you can fill your belly forever and you are always satisfied. But instead of food, it's Jesus. All-you-can-eat buffet of the Lord. So I am so excited. I hope you're excited about heaven. How can I get to heaven? You can get to heaven by saying yes to Jesus. Mother Teresa, who is an awesome, awesome rock star saint, she said, all you have to do to get to heaven is say yes to God. So at every moment, all the saints knew this. It was a secret of the saints. All they had to do is say yes to God, and they kept saying yes. Also, another thing that you can do is go and visit Jesus in the Blessed Sacrament. Go to church and just spend time with the Lord. Because in heaven, that's all you're doing is you're spending time with him. All right, boys and girls, it was great to answer your questions today on Juicebox. Do you have any more questions for a priest? Please reach out. Please send in some questions at juicebox at spiritjuice.com. God bless. See you next time. Juicebox.